we made the Odessa show. The main object is so-called an arch. They dance and sing on it. It's a chamber musical with early 20th century songs. The project was interesting and successful. Our cooperation shaped well, so we went on collaborating with the idea. I believe we have worked at two projects, Odessa, the musical and this project, Nightmares Demon. After the Odessa show, we worked at the same stage, but with another stage director. We made a goblet for an acrobat performance. Then Ilya got back and we set to work at the freak opera Nightmare Demon. That's how we got teamed up. When there is no some standard stage, there is no lock on to a certain theater. On the one hand, it's true that it is not a stage, it's a restaurant, a show hall. But on the other hand, it's put up in ancient Greece manner. There is an amphitheater. In just the same way, there is a live audience. There are just the same side scenes. As well, there is a stage director, actors. As well, there is sound and light. They sell the seats. There are all the theater components. There is a clock room, a entrance. As for me, I didn't have to fit in this stage. I mean the acting area. I accepted as given, as the choice of the game. It was interesting for me to work with this stage. It is very special. The personnel there is very special too. Maybe it was easier to deal with them than with some stage stuff. They are more sane, more quiet. In private, such personnel is hard to find, even in a professional theater. Entering this room, this space, being aware that it is not a professional theater, you can't even demand some special conditions. And all of a sudden, they volunteer. Shakespeare is always a fruitful theme. Especially a Midsummer Night Dream. It can be staged on and on many times. In the 21st, 22nd, 25th century. The task was to perform a show, not a dramatic or musical spectacle. The story itself made us to get with it. This is the play that can absorb a notion of metamorphosis and interpretation. The play that doesn't bound the fantasy of the director and the composer, the scriptwriter, the librettist, all the people that worked at the show. It has been made there, and it seems most natural in that space. I think the stage itself could bring some excess sense. This specific idea could have been read some other way. The public that attends this place, that contingent, will be interested. Maybe it will drive somebody to read over, to review A Midsummer's Night Dream, to change their attitude to Shakespeare. If anything, the stage helped.